Come on, come on. Come on. Come on, bro. Oh. Oh. Get the work, baby. So. 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 What's going on guys, it's your boy CMB, back in the building, back with another video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Now guys, let's get into this one really quickly. Uh, today we're talking about Canelo Alvarez, guys. Uh, you guys know he is the face of boxing. He's on a quest right now to become undisputed at 168, guys. He's only one more title away, and that title was held by Caleb Sweehan's plant. Now, you guys just saw the video uh, footage I played there. Uh, it was some leaked sparring footage of Canelo Alvarez sparring with uh, Ronald Ellis. Uh, if you guys aren't familiar with Ronald Ellis, uh, he is a super uh, middleweight boxer. Uh, his last fight, he fought against David Benavidez. Uh, hell of a fight, guys. A uh, couple of hard-hitting guys. I think Benavidez stopped him uh, in the 11th round with a TKO. But uh, Canelo's getting a lot of criticism for the footage uh, being touched up a little bit by, by Ronald Ellis. But here's the thing, guys. Uh, Ronald Ellis is a taller fighter. He's a more rangier fighter. Uh, Canelo Alvarez is gonna have to come in on him. So he's gonna get touched up a little bit. And at the same time, uh, he was countering Ellis uh, with body shots. So it wasn't like he was just hitting Canelo and Canelo wasn't firing back. But I think this is good work. Uh, for Canelo Alvarez uh, to get into the ring and spar with somebody like Ronald Ellis. Uh, he did give David Benavidez a hell of a fight. And, you know, being at super middleweight, you know, Canelo's smaller in stature than a lot of these fighters. Uh, he's going to be smaller in stature going in with Caleb Plant. So I, I think this is good work. Uh, the criticism, I, I think, is a little bit too much uh, from it. You know, all the time you're not going to have your best sparring days. And uh, leaking sparring footage, uh, that's, that's something that they didn't do in the past. Uh, we, seem, we tend to see that a lot more now these days. And uh, uh, it's, it's not a good thing in my opinion. I think sparring should stay uh, private because you're, you're working on some things and you're, and you're trying to uh, hone your skills. I, I don't think it should be put out there like that. The other camp looks at it and, and analyzes it and you know people make all types of criticism because you know you can have one good sparring day and then the next day you know it's not so great so uh i think it's just a little bit too much criticism uh with the leaked sparring footage with him and ronald ellis but uh i think the fight is uh almost done guys it's, it's not completely official yet but it seemed to be veering that direction uh with him and caleb plant uh, i'm hearing maybe the mgm grand I'm also hearing T-Mobile, so we're just going to have to stay tuned and see what happens uh, with that. But you guys tell me what you think about the sparring footage uh, with Canelo Alvarez. Uh, do you think people were being a little bit over, overly critical of him? Uh, do you think he has a chance with Caleb Plant if the fight takes place? Uh, let me know in the comment section, guys. It's the CMB. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. And I'm out. Peace.